The Shannon Weaver model is one of the first and the most influential models of communication. This was designed by Claude Shannon and Warren Weaver in 1948. The model is specially designed to develop the effective communication between the sender and the receiver. They also found factors that are affecting the communication process, such as the noise. At first, the model was developed to improve the technical communication, and then later, it was widely applied in the field of communication. The Shannon Weaver model deals with various concepts like the information source or the sender, the transmitter or the encoder, and then the channel in which the noise is present, the reception or the decoder, and lastly is the destination or the receiver. Now, let us show you a scenario depicting the Shannon Weaver model of communication. Hello, Mr. Secretary. Good morning. Good morning, ma'am. Lupita speaking. Is there something I can do for you, ma'am? I need your help at the office tomorrow. We have a project to be finished and also upcoming appointments with our business partners. I want you to set the schedule for me. Will you be able to report to the office tomorrow? They said your daughter got sick. How is she? My apologies for the sudden leave, ma'am. As of now, I'm monitoring my daughter's health. The doctor has given her medications and she's getting well. But I'm afraid I can't assure you right now if I'm able to be around at the office tomorrow. Oh, I see. It's fine, Ms. Dapitan. I'm just having a hard time working with our loaded projects here. Just take your time in there, but still, I'm hoping for your presence tomorrow, praying for your daughter's health. Thank you so much for your <laughs> Sorry, Ms. Dapitan. I can't hear you. Sorry, Ms. Dapitan, I can't hear you. Hello, ma'am? Hello? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay, sorry for the inconvenience, ma'am. I just wanted to say thank you for your compassion. I'll just send you an update tonight if I'm able to report to the office tomorrow. I'll be working on the plans and solutions for our management. Also, the schedules need to be set. Is there more anything you'd like me to do, ma'am? I guess that would be all, Ms. Dapitan. Thank you. Goodbye, Ms. Secretary, and have a good day. Okay, thank you, ma'am. God bless and goodbye. In the shown scenario, notice that communication is not a one-way process in this model. Here, the sender plays the primary role, and then the receiver plays the secondary role. And most importantly, understanding the noise will help to solve the various problems of communication in this model.